Hello guys, welcome back to the video. Today we will be discussing about the synthesis and degradation of leucine. Leucine is a branched chain amino acid and it has an isobutyl R group in its structure. This is the isobutyl R group and this is the structure of leucine. Leucine is represented in three letters by LEU and single letter representation is capital L. It is a ketogenic amino acid because its degradation leads to the formation of acetoacetate and acetyl-CoA. Now, let us move on to the biosynthesis of leucine. The first five steps of leucine synthesis is similar to that of valine synthesis. It is described in detail in that video, so you can check that video for detailed explanation of the first five steps. Now, let us start. So, the first starting material is pyruvate. Here, this pyruvate forms an adduct with TPP and upon decarboxylation forms hydroxyethyl TPP intermediate. This hydroxyethyl TPP joins with the keto group of another pyruvate in presence of acetolactate acetate synthase and forms alpha acetolactate. This alpha acetolactate then undergoes isomerization in presence of isomerase enzyme to form an intermediate. The intermediate thus formed undergoes reduction in presence of reductase enzyme to form alpha beta dihydroxy isovalerate. This alpha beta dihydroxy isovalerate undergoes dehydration in presence of dehydratase enzyme that is the removal of water molecule from this compound to form alpha keto isovalerate. This alpha keto isovalerate along with acetyl CoA and with the addition of water molecule forms alpha isopropyl malate. So here, this SCOA gets cleaved by the water molecule and one of the hydrogen of water molecule gets removed with this SCOA as coa -SH. Then this CH3 group attaches with this carbon and uh, forms this bond. So the one of the hydrogen of this CH3 molecule gets attached with this oxygen and forms an OH group there. Then one of the remaining OH group of this water molecule attaches with this C double bond O to form this carboxylic acid group. This alpha isopropyl malate is formed. This alpha isopropyl malate then undergoes isomerization in presence of isomerase enzyme to form iso beta isopropyl malate. So this beta isopropyl malate undergoes dehydrogenation and decarboxylation to form alpha keto isocaproate. Here, the CO2 gets removed from this carboxylic acid group and this hydrogen joins with the CH to form CH2 here. Then, two hydrogen gets removed with NAD+. So, one of the hydrogen is removed from here and one of the hydrogen is removed from here. Thus, two hydrogen gets removed and forms this C double bond O bond. So, this is the dehydrogenation reaction. So, beta isopropyl malate gets converted to alpha keto isocaproate. This alpha keto isocaproate then undergoes transamination reaction to form leucine. So here, um, this keto group gets changed with amino group and thus forms the leucine. So this is all about the synthesis of leucine. Now let us move on to the degradation of leucine. Leucine degradation starts with transamination reaction. Here, the NH2 group of leucine gets replaced with an oxygen group that is a keto group and forms alpha keto isocaproate. This alpha keto isocaproate then undergoes decarboxylation and dehydrogenation to form isovaleryl CoA in presence of decarboxylase enzyme. So, here this COO group is removed as CO2 and the remaining H along with the hydrogen of CoA SH gets removed with NADH2. And this remaining S-CoA directly attaches with this carbon and forms isovaleryl CoA. This isovaleryl CoA thus formed undergoes dehydrogenation reaction where FAD acts as a coenzyme in presence of dehydrogenase enzyme to form beta methylcrotonyl CoA. So here the two hydrogen groups are removed from here and from here and a double bond formed there in between that carbon atoms. So beta methylcrotonyl CoA is formed. This beta methyl crotonyl CoA undergoes carboxylation reaction in presence of carboxylase enzyme and also in presence of ATP to form beta methyl glutaconyl CoA. So here the CO2 is added to this carbon and one of the hydrogen of this CH3 molecule attaches with that CO2 to form COOH group here. 
then uh, we got beta methyl glutaconyl coa this beta methyl glutaconyl coa then undergoes hydration in presence of hydratase enzyme to form beta methyl beta hydroxy beta methyl glutaryl coa or hmg coa here the oh group of uh, water molecule gets added to the carbon to this carbon and the hydrogen of uh, water molecule gets attaches with this ch group and from ch2 here thus we got hmg coa the hmg coa thus formed undergoes cleavage in presence of hmg coa lyase to form acetoacetate and acetyl coa the cleavage occurs here and this much group leaves as acetyl coa this ch2 group accepts this hydrogen leaving this bond as double bond and forms acetyl coa here then this much remaining portion is acetoacetate so this is all about the synthesis and degradation of lysine